Question 19. Determine vector equation of a line perpendicular to the line r equals to 1, 2, 3 plus t, 4, 1, 2. Okay. Try to do your solution and then look into my suggestion. So here is how we are going to do it. So we need a perpendicular line. That means the vector direction, the direction vector should be perpendicular to this given line. How can we find that? So we'll use the dot product, right? If dot product is zero, then the two vectors are perpendicular. So let us assume that the perpendicular line has a direction vector m, which could be written as a, b, and c, right? In that case, dot product of 4, 1, 2 with a, b, c should be 0, right? Correct. So let's do it. Just 4a plus b plus 2c equals to 0. <clears throat> now you see, we have one equation and three variables, right? So this equation cannot be solved easily, right? So what you have to do is, you have to assume two values to get the third one. <laughs> and that is what we call parameters, correct? So you just assume. So best thing to assume here is, let us say b equals to 0. So if b equals to 0, then what happens? You could choose any value, okay? But zeros and ones are very good values to always use, okay? So if b is 0, then we land up with 4a plus 2c equals to 0. Still, we don't know what a and c could be. Now, to make this equation 0, we'll again assume some value, right? So the best combination could be that if I assume a as 1, let us say if a is 1, then so I'm just telling you steps which are good to find solutions to these tricky problems, okay? If a is 1, then what happens? Then we get 4 plus 2c equals to 0, right? And well, now we can solve for c, right? So 2c equals to minus 4 and c equals to minus 4 divided by 2, which is minus 2. Perfect. So this is how you are going to solve these equations, right? Yes, I've been watching students struggling to get these kinds of answers and like, what to do now? There's just one equation, three variables. So make a choice, right? Start assuming values. Zeros and ones are the best values to choose. So what did we find here? We got these values for our ABC and therefore, our direction vector now is A is 1, B is 0, and c is minus 2. And therefore, we can write this. We can use the same point, right? So we say our vector equation is 1, 2, 3. That's the point, right? Plus t. You may use t, s, p, whatever you want. Let me write s this time. How does it matter, right? And that's my direction vector. 1, 0, minus 2. So this line is perpendicular to the given line. How will you show it? Well, you can always find dot product between these two, just to be sure, right? 4, 1, 2. This is just a check, right? Minus 2. Let's see what this is. 4 times 1 is 4. 1 times 0 is 0. And 2 times minus 2 is minus 4. And we get 0. Perfect. So this is just the right answer we're looking for. Remember, there could be many more solutions to this, right? But this is definitely one of the correct ones. Thank you.